Hey, Bolo Buddies, thanks for watching. Okay, so I just figured out how I can put my picture here so it still seems personal without having to have it in my face all the time. So this is kind of an unexpected video. I was just thinking about it and, you know, it's been a long day and I just don't feel like being on video, but I want to share this with you. So this is what you're going to get. Anyway, um, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe below. And I'm going to talk to you a little bit about promoted listings. And um, I'm going to shrink this down. I'll just be hanging out over here. Um, so I do 1%. And I'm pretty sure I've been at 1% for the last 31 days. Sometimes I'll mix it up and go up to 3%. And there for a while, I was doing the recommended um, amount that the trending amount for the item. It's, I don't know, eBay bases it on some equation or formula, I guess I should say, that they have. And it's basically what other people that are selling in the same categories are selling things for. And that's the percent they're using, supposedly. But I feel like at 1%, I'm going to get the extra exposure. They're going to show my item twice. And that's kind of what I'm sticking with right now. So I kind of wanted to show you something here. Um, Again, most of the items that I sell are clothing. Um, I am trying to branch out. That is why I started the Bolo Buddies uh, Facebook group and the YouTube channel is because I am sick of selling clothing. I have clothes that I have been sitting on for like three years, some five years. It is crazy. Um, but I just let them sit. And I don't make, I don't revise my items like I should. I just have so much listed that I just let them sit until the right buyer comes along. And I'm okay with that because right now I have the space for it. But I want to do, I want to find bolos. I want to find the items to be on the lookout for that I can buy low and sell high. That's what's fun to me. This clothing stuff, I'm just kind of bored with it. Got to tell you. All right. So the whole point of the video is to explain promoted listings. So. 1%. So you can see in the last 31 days, promoted listings only, I have sold 56 items. And at 1%, maybe some of them are more than 1% because that's that math is not adding up. Maybe I have them at 2%. I can't remember, but it's 1% or 2%. It's low. Um, so my total sales for the 56 items was $1,132. And my total fees were $22.66. So that this is a small number to sell this many items and to have this kind of sales. So in my opinion, I like promoted listings. Some like it, some don't. Comment below, what do you think? Um, so I just wanna show you something here. Um, so this is a newer item. This one, uh, I probably had a year, six months to a year, so I was happy to sell that. This is a newer item. This I got last summer at a garage sale. So I was really excited to, to sell that. I bought this. This is a bolo. I bought it for five bucks at a garage sale and I sold it for $82. So pretty cool. This I've probably had a couple years. Um, this, oh my gosh, this skirt I have probably had for five, maybe six years. I only sold it for 10 bucks. eBay took their 20 cents. And you know what? I am just thrilled to have it gone. I still made a profit. I think I paid three bucks for the skirt. So super excited to have that gone. This one I'd had a long time. So I'm going to call these stale listings. This one was stale. This one was stale. This one's newer, newer. Uh, let's see. I'm going to find some more stale ones and just this one. I wouldn't say stale. I've sold a lot of them, but probably had it at least a year, but I had multiples, um, but happy to sell it. Let's see. This one, oh, probably had it four years. These two, I've had these probably three to five years. Same with this one. So these were all three stale listings. And you can see I'm selling them cheap, but I don't care. I just want to get rid of them and I'm still making a profit. That's the, this probably five years old. Um, let's see. I'm just going to tell you the ones that are stale. I'll call them stale. This is an older item. I've had it probably a couple years, but these are, you know, homecoming, prom, bridesmaids, um, 
they're kind of a hard item to sell because you have to have the right buyer. This one was a stale listing. This one was a stale listing. And when I say stale, I've had I have had it over a year. That's a safe number. This one over a year. Uh stale. Stale. Um stale, but I had multiples and I sold out of the other ones quickly. I don't know why this one so took so long to sell. Um and these are these are newer. So I'm going to count them up here. And let's see. I had one I'm going to count up the ones that I've had for over a year. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So 15 stale listings have sold using promoted listings. But I will tell you, I have had a lot of stale listings selling lately. I don't know what's going on. Um, I am running sales. I'm doing buy uh, two or more, buy one, get one 30% off. I think that's the sale I have going on right now. Um, and then if you purchase two or more items from my store, you get $5 shipping flat rate. So I am doing things like that, but I feel that promoted listings on eBay is a great resource. If you're not using it, I highly recommend it. Um, I do my entire store. You do not have to do your entire store. That's just what I choose to do. Um, because you only pay if it sells. So if the item does not sell, you're out nothing. Um, and if it does, you know, at 1%, so I must have this at 2% because it, uh, so 2250 this sold for, I gave eBay 45 cents, which is 2%. So I must have them on 2%. I was thinking one, but I think I changed it to 2%. So I just let them run. So I kind of forget, but I probably should have checked that before I started the video. But anyway, um, I just wanted to share that with you guys in case any of you are thinking about promoted listings or have questions about promoted listings. If you have questions, feel free to comment. I'll do my best to answer. Um, I've been using it since it came out and I like it. I like selling my stale listings. Now, when I list something new, I'm kind of like, oh, you know, but it's no big deal. It It's, you know, 1% or 2%. So it's not a big amount and it's worth getting the sale. It's bumping your listing up so that more people see it. So again, comment below, like this video if you like it. And, um, if you haven't subscribed already, please do that. Thanks for watching.